Well, hello everyone. My name is Mighty Stream. I'm going to do your March the 9th just for today in a meditation. You can reach me at recoveryofhope 21 at gmail.com. The title of the meditation just for today is Small Things. In the past, we made simple situations into problems. We made mountains out of molehills. That's taken from the basic text, page 90. Making mountains out of molehills seems to be our specialty. Have you ever heard it said that to an addict, a flat tire is a traumatic event? Or how about those of us who forget all pretense of principle when confronted? with a bad driver and what about that can opener that won't work you know the one you just threw out the second story window we can relate when we hear others share god grant me patience right now (laughs) no it's not the major setbacks that drive us to destruction the big things divorce death serious illness the loss of a job, will throw us, but we survive them. We've learned from experience that we must reach out to our higher power and others to make it through life's major crises. It's the small things, the constant day-to-day challenges of living life without the use of drugs that seem to affect most addicts most strongly in recovery. When the little things get to us, the serenity prayer can help us regain our perspective. We can all remember that turning over these small matters to the care of a higher power results in peace of mind and a refreshed perspective on the way. Just for today, I will work on patience. I will try to keep from blowing things out of proportion and walk with my higher power through my day. Let's take a moment of silence followed by the we version of the serenity prayer. Thank you. God, grant us the serenity to accept the things that we cannot change, the courage to change the things that we can, and the wisdom to know the difference. Just for today, please and thank you. Small thing. It's true. I I do believe that we as recovering individuals still have the tendency to exaggerate situations. Uh, We tend to make mountains out of molehills. And we've learned it. We've learned it over the years. So it's difficult to unlearn. And what I would have to say about that, for many of us, we see larger circumstances or situations such as divorce and death. We see those sort of things that pop up unexpectedly as being something that we're definitely committed to our recovery. We're in part of the no matter what club we will not use no matter what. And then when something minor comes up, like your child brings home an F, you lose it. I think many of us can relate to that. Today, what I want for you to do is to remember this, practice makes perfect. But in our situation, practice makes progress. We aim to have less and less and less and less opportunities or times when we actually do make mountains out of mountain hills. That's the end game. And that's all that it is, is Our intention, intention, excuse me, to not have situations take us out 
of the box completely. So commit with me today, just for today, that you'll work on patience. You will try to keep from blowing things out of proportion and walk with your higher power through your whole day. And if you need to readjust your outputs of the day, just do it. No one's grading you on this. Your highest critic is going to be yourself. No one is grading you on this. However, the good things that can come from keeping things in their proper perspective is without limit. And it's going to take practice. So no better day to start than today. My name is Mighty Stream, and I've enjoyed talking to you. I hope that you have a beautiful day on purpose, and I will be talking to you tomorrow.